what's going on there. Well, welcome back to the show. We didn't quite finish. We were nearly at the end of the second half, which is a bit sad. Uh, because So we had the Fact Hunt people, and then we had the Times people, and then at four o'clock yesterday afternoon, I had a letter from YouTube, who said that my phone-in on the 24th of January was cyberbullying. And I thought, well, if that's cyberbullying, every other fucking phone in cyber cyberbullying because they're all the same. Could, could I have a glass of water, by the way, or a pint? Actually, I can have a pint. I've got. I'm driving back. I'll have one pint, please. Could I? No, no. Oh, th is that for me? Is it? No, I don't want fucking cola. I want some alcohol. In that bad. <laughs> cola. I think I'm lying on my feet. Anyway. <laughs> Anyway, so uh, what was I said? Yes, so we had this thing, cyberbullying, and they said, right, right, strike one, 90 days. And I thought, hello, hang on a minute. So we had Bethany from the Fact Hunters, and then we had the men from the Times with the thing, I didn't get to it, I don't think. He said, uh, Carol Vorderman said you were misogynistic. That was a tweet from 18 months ago. There's no way he could have known about that unless he was given it by somebody who wants to bring... Why do you pull a fucking pint like that? Jesus Christ. It's got bigger head than Katie Price. <laughs> Cheers, everyone. Yeah. She's all right, by the way. They've got her out and uh, we'll find out. And uh, so, that happened. And then 10 minutes later, there came another note from YouTube. Three strikes and you're out, by the way. And the second one said, uh, we have pulled this video from Thursday for misogyny. On Thursday, I did a video. <laughs> On Thursday, I did a video about a lady called Carol Vorden, who, <laughs> who has sold her 2.4 million pound mansion. And she's moved in a caravan. And all I said was, how's she going to get through the doors of the caravan with those big tits and fat ass? Now, <laughs> well, you see in the mansion, there's two big flat doors. You know, two big flats. Think Gemma Collins. Two big flat <laughs> Have you seen that tent outside? It looks like fucking Gemma Collins' knickers. It stinks like it, too. And the... So, another 90-day strike. So I'm banned for two weeks. But what this is, well, what this is, is the beginning of the end. But here's where I'm at. Everybody around me is losing their heads, upset and crying or whatever. Listen, I have got away, and I stand with pride, for two years getting away with more than anyone else in show business history. And I stand proud that for two years we got away with it. And if only now they're going to start thinking I'm misogynistic, sexist, racist, homophobic, transphobic, and fucking cyberbullying, that we'll go somewhere else. So here's where we're at today. We're off air for two weeks. Well, I need a break anyway. This week I've done five fucking shows for Jim Davis, and I've done 110 videos for you, two live phone-ins, driven fucking 700 miles, Let's have a few days off. It's no problem. The lads are working at a place we can go. 